Experiment 1. Determination of pH of various solutions using pH paper or universal indicator solution. Aim to find the pH of number 1. Dilute HCl. Number 2. Dilute solution of NaOH. Number 3. Dilute solution of acetic ethanoic acid. Number 4. Lemon juice. Number 5. Water. Number 6. Dilute solution of sodium bicarbonate. By using A. pH paper. B. Universal indicator solution. Requirements Test tubes, test tube stand, dropper, white glaze tile, pH paper or universal indicator solution, distilled water, and solutions of given samples. Procedure A. By using pH paper, number 1, take 6 clean and dry test tubes. Label the test tubes as A, B, C, D, E, and F and place them in order in a test tube stand. Take 10 milliliter of each given sample in the test tubes. Now, place a small piece of pH paper about 2 cm on white glaze tile. With the help of a dropper, Transfer 1 to 2 drops of dilute HCl from test tube A on the pH paper. Observe the color developed on pH paper and compare it with the colors in the chart on the cover of the pH paper booklet. Note the pH given against the color which tallies with developed color on pH paper. Now repeat the same procedure for other samples and note their pH in the observation table. Here is the observation table. Let us fill the observation table. Now you know the samples are dilute HCl, dilute solution of NaOH, dilute solution of acetic or ethanoic acid, lemon juice, Water, dilute solution of NaHCO3. Now, let us see the values of pH using universal indicator. Now, take six clean and dry test tubes. Label the test tubes as A, B, C, D, E, and F and place them in order in a test tube stand. Take 10 ml of each given sample in the test tubes. Add 2 drops of BDH universal indicator with the help of a dropper to each test tube. Now BDH is British Drug House. Observe carefully the color of solution in each test tube and match it with different color shades given on the universal indicator bottle. Note the pH given against the color which tallies with the developed color in the solution of each sample. Now repeat the same procedure for other samples and note the pH in the observation table. Now this is the observation table, same as the earlier table. Inference number 1, acid samples with pH less than 7. Number 2, basic samples with pH more than 7. Neutral samples with pH is equal to 7.